Coach Brown on the Kings' performance against the Pelicans. Check out the video. Yeah, give give them a lot of credit. Uh, that's three games in a row. They kind of did the same thing. They were a more physical team. Uh, their length, their athleticism bothered us. Um, you know, I, I thought that uh, um, obviously B.I. had a heck of a game, you know, scoring 30 on 50% shooting from the floor. <clears throat> so he did what he, what he was supposed to do. Uh, a guy like Herb Jones, you know, for him to go get 23 on 8 for 13 from the floor, uh, Ken, you got to give him credit. That's something that you hope that doesn't happen, especially if you're, you know, if you're limiting uh, Zion to, to eight shots and, and, and 10 points. You hope a guy like Herb Jones doesn't get to the rim time after time after time for, for a dunk. Um, but I, I thought that at the end of the day, uh, it was their bench. Their, their bench. Uh, man, I, t- I tell you what, they. You got to give credit where credit's due. Obviously, Tra- uh, Trey Murphy had a big game uh, for him, <clears throat> and you know, from time to time, they, you know, he's long, he can shoot it. That's expected. But the, the, the guy that's kicked our behind, I know for sure, two straight games. I can't. Might maybe three is is Alvarado. You, you got to give that man a lot of credit. That man came into the game. He changed the game. Uh, he was physical with us. Smallest player on the floor, but he impacted the game at the highest level. Uh, every minute that he was on the floor, and uh, and we paid the price for it. So uh, give those guys a ton of credit because they came in here and they earned the win. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next video, Hoop Life Family.